Can you tell us a little more about children in poverty so people can understand what it's like for them in their daily life, maybe hunger on the weekends, different issues that come up that make it so difficult sometimes to graduate high school? Right. School is a challenge to begin with. I believe it has its obstacles and it's uh, becoming more and more rigorous. For someone that lives in middle class, imagine living in poverty and having, having added challenges uh, added to you, barriers, obstacles uh, to uh, interfere in what you're trying to accomplish in school. Imagine a child living in a food insecure home, maybe a food desert. You may have a home where you don't have the amount of money that you need in order to provide food for a child. And if you're living in a food insecure home, there's you a double whammy. That means that you don't have a grocery store that is in the area for you to get to. Uh, that's a challenge as well. A lot of times when a child lives in a food insecure home, the only option that they have afforded to them is to walk to a convenience store. The only thing that they're able to purchase really is maybe a, a soda and a bag of chips. That child is living in in a food insecure home so they don't receive the nutrition that they need. The only nutrition that that child may receive is in the school system uh, Monday through Friday and on the weekend they, they lack food, they lack nutrition so when they go back to school on Monday they don't go in wide-eyed and focused and uh, thinking about how they'll pass the math test. Their thought is I'm hungry and what they went through the, the weekend before.